the one crucial parenting tip Prince William and Kate Middleton swear by. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge's parenting is enviable and inspirational. While you'd likely never catch them making these terrible mistakes, there is always room for improvement. With baby no. 3 on the way. Prince William recently revealed the one way they plan to detour from the traditional parenting roles of the royals who came before them. Read on their top parenting tips, as well as the one crucial tip they swear by, C.015. They aren't afraid to seek help. The royal family has the resources to afford and access the kind of parenting help many can only dream of such as a live-in nanny. But their past actions indicate they love to rely on family. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge were spotted in Buckleberry at Middleton's family home just a day after the birth of Prince George. The couple stayed with her family for a few weeks and utilized her parents' help during the start of their son's life. 4. They focus on their own mental health. Parenting is tough and parenting royal children comes with additional pressure that we won't even attempt to comprehend. Middleton spoke at the launch of Best Beginnings film series Out of the Blue this past March. During her speech, she was honest about how challenging parenting is, even for the royal family. Middleton encouraged listeners to address the mental difficulties associated with becoming a parent head-on. If any of us caught a fever during pregnancy, we would seek advice and support from a doctor she said. Getting help with our mental health is no different. Our children need us to look after ourselves and get the support we need. 3. They don't stress the small stuff. We found that on more than one occasion the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge showed great composure and patience when dealing with the inevitable toddler temper tantrums. While some may say they're putting on a good face for the camera, it seems as if the royal couple simply opts to remain calm when parenting gets rough. If Prince George's Air Force encounter or his handshake snub with Prime Minister Justin Trudeau are any indication, the couple knows how to remain stress-free when disaster strikes. 2. They use parenting books and make their own rules. Kate sent a fan letter to the anonymous author of The Modern Mother's Handbook, How to Raise a Happy, Healthy, Smart, Disciplined, and Interesting Child starting from birth. The letter indicated Kate's affinity toward the parenting guide. A fellow mother of two wrote the book as a practical guide to raising children from childbirth into their formative teenage years. Kate also proved to be a resource herself, offering this advice at the launch event for the Best Beginnings film series. There is no rule book, no right or wrong, you just have to make it up and do the very best you can to care for your family. 1. They encourage their children to express their Prince William and his brother, Harry, recently interviewed with Comzine, a publication run by the British mental health organization Campaign Against Living Miserably. The brothers went into great detail about the stigma on emotional expression, especially among men in the United Kingdom. Prince William conveyed how crucial he feels a comfortable emotional environment is to a healthy lifestyle, saying, Catherine and I are clear that we want both George and Charlotte to grow up feeling able to talk about their emotions and feelings. This strategy is great as it deviates from the royal family's history of aversion to emotional expression. This removes the stigma of discussing mental health. Both the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge as well as Prince Harry are charity partners for the UK mental health organization heads together. This association indicates their belief in destigmatizing the mental health discussion. Prince William delved into the taboo on discussing anxiety and mental health concerns in the interview with Comzine. He recognized that everyone, successful, strong people included, suffer from similar issues. The issue he, Kate, and Harry seem to be focused on fighting is the lack of discussion around these topics. Prince William has hope for the new generation. The Duke of Cambridge expressed that he is confident that a new generation of children will grow up able to express their emotions. We have visited a number of schools together where we have been amazed listening to children talk, in a really clear and emotionally articulate way. Seeing this has really given me hope that things are changing and that there is a generation coming up who find it normal to talk openly about their emotions, he told Comzine.